Hi, I'm Chris Heath. I'm a parishioner at the Episcopal Church of the Epiphany in Richardson, Texas. Welcome. Thank you for joining us. Um, I'm, I'm here to do an order of service for noonday, uh, and thank you for joining us. We have services three times a day here on Facebook uh, Live, and um, uh, and these are transferred over to YouTube also, and and they're uh, enduring, so you can you know watch these at other times too. But I uh, appreciate um, everyone who's t who's uh, tuning in now. Um, now we use the uh, Book of Common Prayer. Oh, let me make sure I'm live. Yes. Okay. One second. We use the uh, Book of Common Prayer. Uh, all the prayers that I'll say are, are uh, uh, in, in this book on page 103, actually, or this is available online also. So we start at 1210. You know, uh, uh, these we hold these at 8 in the morning, 8 at night, and 1210 in the afternoon. So thank you for joining us. Let's get started. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Now I'm going to read uh, Psalm 121 on page 104. I lift up my eyes to the hills. From where is my help to come? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. He will not let your foot be moved, for he who watches over you will not fall asleep. Behold, he who keeps watch over Israel shall neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord himself watches over you. The Lord is your shade at your right hand, so that the sun shall not strike you by day nor the moon by night. The Lord shall preserve you from all evil. It is he who shall keep you safe. The Lord shall watch over your going out and your coming in from this time forth forevermore. Now, page 105. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Now at the top of page 106. If anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has passed away. Behold, the new has come. All this is from God, who through Christ reconciled us to himself and gave us the ministry of reconciliation. Thanks be to God. Now is a moment that we, uh, um, uh, I, I encourage us all to have our own intentions and personal uh, prayer on, on our hearts. Uh, you can, you can ha speak them uh, aloud, have them, uh, uh, keep them silent. Uh, you can even uh, type these onto this Facebook post. Uh, feel free to, and we have a prayer team that collects these and we hold them in our hearts as well. Let us pray. Hmm. Amanda asks uh, for us to pray for the hurricane victims in Honduras and Central America. Indeed, uh, th there's been two awful hurricanes, uh, and um, it, it, let us pray for them as well. Amen. Lord have mercy. Christ have mercy. Lord have mercy. <clears throat> now that our Father on the left side of the page. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer, and let our cry come to you. 
Now the prayer in the middle of page 107. Let us pray. Almighty Savior, who at noonday called your servant, St. Paul, to be an apostle to the Gentiles, we pray you to illumine the world with the radiance of your glory, that all nations may come and worship you. For you live and reign forever and ever. Amen. So, to conclude, let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thank you for joining us. Uh, again, we're here three times a day uh, uh, here on Facebook Live, or uh, you can find us on YouTube as well. Um, thank you for joining. Have a blessed day.